We don't give much thought to what happens when we do that little twist in the morning. In San Diego County, each person uses about 120 gallons of water a day. And because water is such a precious resource, the San Diego County Water Authority and its member agencies work hard every day to ensure that everyone has a safe and reliable water supply. So, how do we do it? Like all good things, it starts with a plan. Meet the Urban Water Management Plan. It's a foundational document that identifies the water supplies necessary to meet our region's water needs now and in the future. We coordinate with the Water Authority's 24 member agencies in preparation of the plan and must submit the plan to the State of California every five years. So let's dive into the five main elements of the plan. The first element is demand forecast. This estimates future water demands for the region's more than 3 million residents. Those demands fall into two classes of service, municipal and industrial water used by homes and businesses and agricultural water use. Accurate forecasting is critical to securing water supplies to meet these demands, especially when they vary over time. In 2007, water demand in San Diego reached a record high level. But since then, adoption of water-efficient products and practices have significantly decreased annual water usage. And due to these efforts, we do not anticipate that it will reach that level again in the near future. So where does all this needed water come from? The second major element that the plan evaluates are the sources of water supply available to the Water Authority and its member agencies. For many years, San Diego's water mostly came from the State Water Project in Northern California and the Colorado River via the Metropolitan Water District of Southern California. But in the early 1990s, the state was hit with a drought and the San Diego region experienced a significant cut in its water supply. To ensure the San Diego region would have its own more reliable supplies, the Water Authority began to diversify its water supply mix. Today, our water supplies include multiple sources, and about 70% of the region's water supplies are from these locally controlled water sources, with a planned increase to that supply in the future. A third element of the plan is data on water use efficiency. Technology has delivered hundreds of water efficiencies to market and has effectively reduced overall water waste. High efficiency toilets, air-cooled ice machines, and water smart landscapes are just a few examples of water efficiency innovations. Since 1990, people in the San Diego region have reduced water use by nearly half, despite a 37% increase in population. Yet, smart water planning requires more than forecasting and efficiency. The fourth element to consider is scenario planning. To ensure long-term water reliability, the Water Authority needs to anticipate and plan for different scenarios that may impact the region's water supplies over the next 25 to 50 years. Scenario planning requires lots of complex modeling and analysis to imagine different potential scenarios based on region-specific variables. For example, climate change could have numerous impacts, including sea level rise, temperature increase, and drought all factors that could impact the availability of water. Water shortage planning is the final element of the plan. As Californians, we know that we must plan for droughts and earthquakes, even if we don't know for certain when they might happen. Water planners must prepare for these and other potential threats and have strategies in place to ensure the safety and reliability of our water supply. Planners also address how water supplies should be allocated to regional member agencies in the event of a water shortage. As a collaborative, comprehensive planning document, the plan also informs other water authority and regional planning efforts, including the Water Authority's Regional Facilities Master Plan Update. Using analysis from the plan, we are able to inform the Facilities Master Plan, which is essential to building and optimizing water supply infrastructure years in advance. This is critical since planning, permitting, and construction can take many years to complete. Recent infrastructure developments have included implementation of new conveyance pipelines, water supplies like seawater desal, surface water treatment, and storage facilities that have significantly improved the region's overall water supply reliability. If you live, work, or own a business in the San Diego region, the Urban Water Management Plan impacts you. 
It serves as the cornerstone of the region's water planning activities. With it, we are able to map where we are now and where we need to go, ensuring that our region has a safe and reliable water supply to support the region's economy and enviable quality of life, today and for generations to come.